Also, you got the uh, shape-shifting character. He was trying Zero. to... Zero was trying yeah. to fill in the place of Blanco. Yeah, I don't know. I can't and say Necro that. was kind of strange, too. I think he was trying to fill in the role of Dawson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And 12. I just looks like Toxic Zero. 12 was his name. <laughs> This this version, gameplay wise, it's probably it's definitely the most superior version. It feels more complete to me. Every yes. character has their own fighting style, and the game feels very balanced. Well, no, uh, -uh. Elena can be very unbalanced. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to lie to me like that. Elena is—I'm not saying she cheats or anything, but she can get those legs in it. So like, it's like her. 
Like, if she's compared to Eddie Gordo and Tekken. Anybody can sit there and push buttons. Once her legs get started up, there's really no stopping her. Well, uh, right, right. You know, Saga, he had a little tiger knee, but everyone is deadly. Right. Uh, Chun-Li's thousand leg kick. Mm -hmm. You know. One thing I have to say about Chun-Li is that they switched up her stance and her fighting style. Yeah, I didn't. And I really did not appreciate it. I don't, I don't appreciate it. I don't think a lot of other gamers appreciate that, especially the hardcore Chun-Li fans. Yeah, it's like they made her more, I mean, she's feminine. We already know she's female, but right. she looks more petite. Right. When she's not really petite, she's pretty in the face, don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. But, you know, but I, I just didn't like the way, I mean, I love the way they animated her clothes. Her right. Clothes is like That's wonderful. That's wonderful, but the way they gave her a new stance, that stance just didn't make her... She doesn't look welcoming. She looks like, if you get in my face, I'm going to kick your butt. Right. Kind of, kind of, but not because you're playing beating somebody else up. It's like if you choose her to play with her. Right. You pay the price for picking her. Right. You know, some of her moves are the... the Spinning bird kick or whatever. Yeah, bird kick. Yeah. Oh, they messed that all up. <laughs> <laughs> She's just not Chun-Li to me. It's like a evil twin. Right. She got to kill me. And that's why I don't really play with her no more in the um, game, because she's just... She's just, um, just, just playing not stupid, really. You know, I mean, I'm not saying trying to say stupid. It's just she's not for me anymore. I, I will say this. I'll make a comparison to to this fact. It's the fact that once once people are accustomed to playing a particular character, caught up in the fact that this this character is static and the, the game is static, and they don't want it to change. And that's part of the reason why I don't like playing with Chun Li because I'm so accustomed to playing with Chun Li the way that she was in the past to the point well, that now I don't want to play with her because okay. she, when I go to play with her, she's She's not nearly as potent, you know. I can't, I can't do like she doesn't have air superiority in this game to me. Not anymore. Not part anymore. One, in had. part one, she had air superiority. I mean, whenever she was in the air, you, you had just, three moves to do everything. You could kill her in the head, right? Bounce off the wall, right? And you got the shoulder throw if you want to be cheap, right? I you mean, know? it's like they water her down so much, and I mean, it they was, animated her more and took away too much of her, her abilities. Her abilities, right? She was, yeah. she had air superiority. Because when she was, I mean, like when she was in a fireball fight, who would ever think Chun could ever be in a fireball fight? Nobody. Nobody. And then they put that in Super Street Fighter Turbo, she was in a fireball. Right. Oh, that was hot. And then now they got it where she's like dancing across the screen like she's some ballerina, and she's not a ballerina. I mean, why y'all got it? Why they had to put that in? We still love them, but I don't play with her as much. I would say that. I only play with her when I want when I want to do something stupid. Right. You know. But um, what you think about the backgrounds in the third strike? Background, um, they're better drawn than uh, I would say Alpha Two, but. The color wise, color wise, the game is lacking like a lot of color, man. I guess they tried to give it like this kind of washed out feel to it. If you actually compare this game to Alpha 2, the color wise, it looks more washed out. It gives the game a more refined, old look to it. It feels like the game could have been made prior to the Street Fighter 2, if you ask me, because the way that the color the locations represent, feel authentic. The locations don't really feel authentic to me. Uh, I guess it's just because, um,. They didn't include the maps for one thing. Like on the original Street Fighter Two World Warriors, you always saw the map when you selected your character. You saw oh, well, yeah, the plane flying. Right, it's not World Warriors, and they it's do show you the little flag of like the well, locations not. where each character is from. But take um, you go stage for instance. It's just like this giant attic. Like why would you go be fighting inside this giant attic? You know what I mean? It's just not like a very authentic stage. Yeah, it's like they just took that. Who took, who took something that was laying around like tea table coin up? Right. A tea table coin up. This something we used to play in the office. Right. You know. Yeah, I don't think they took like a lot of thought into making like some authentic backgrounds. But I will have to say that Elena's stage does feel authentic. Oh, the, the, oh, the one where she, is that hers, the level with all the red? Right. With all oh, the red, sunset. Like yeah, yeah, that level is hot. I love the African level. savannah. Yeah, yeah, that's that's real dope. I really I like that. Like that's about the only one I like. I like oral stage too. In the, in the, in the, I think it's oral. It's like in the cave or whatever? No, not that one. This one way on the, there in the, uh, a yard, a lumber yard. Or in a lumber yard. Yeah, I think it's probably uh, yeah, Sean's. Yeah, that, that's Sean's stage too. I don't know why they decided to share stages on this game. I mean, I mean come on, you can't even shut on a shortcut in the game. I mean, give the players, you know, authentic backgrounds for each character. That's one of my gripes about this game. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, this is the backgrounds were lacking a lot, man. Backgrounds were lacking a lot. They could have